So, what is spirituality, Father Rob? That's a big question. Yes. Um, I think the first thing to, to say about that is everybody has a spirituality. Whether they uh, call it that or not, uh, whether that expresses itself uh, through traditional, institutionally, uh, religious systems, um, or whether it's a more personal thing. Uh, human beings have this sense uh, of otherness that is uh, naturally in, in us. And, um, and so I think spirituality is, is, the, is the way in which we experience the other, uh, whether we call that God or um, you know, the spirit or, or uh, even the transcendence of nature. Uh, our spirituality is, is how we experience the other uh, that surrounds us uh, and have a, a sense of, uh, of otherness. And I think for a, a, a healthy second stage of life, uh, we, we need to develop uh, a deep appreciation of, of otherness. It's indicative, I think, of the... Of the the crumbling of the container, uh, when uh, when we can uh, get a deeper sense uh, from our from the contents uh, to the to the to the rest of creation uh, and and beyond. I know that sounds all a bit um, no, nebulous, no, but no, I don't think um, so. Our, our everybody has a spiritual, and, mm. and I, I encounter um, a large number of people who will. Um, uh, invariably say to me something like, I am, uh, I am not religious. Mm. And uh, my response to that is, well, well, tell me about your spirituality. And they'll uh, say, oh, well, I'm not really uh, into that sort of thing. Uh, but uh, then I'll ask other questions like, well, um, uh, tell me about what brings you joy. Mm -hmm. uh, tell me how you experience love. Uh, tell me what your desirings are. Uh, and, and invariably when people start answering those sorts of questions, they are talking about their spirituality. Yes. Uh, and they'll, they'll come to see that they are, they are speaking about otherness, they're speaking about something that is not uh, themselves. And, um, and I, th I believe for, for a healthy human being to exist, uh, there has to be that deep appreciation of the other, mm. um, and, uh, and and I think when we can um, sometimes have a uh, a circle of friends, a community uh, it, with whom we share a a similar form of appreciation, uh, that enhances our our life and our our being as well. So, uh, spirituality in, in all its forms uh, is a very important part. I think especially uh, in the deepening of our second stage of life. Mm. Uh, spirituality in the first stage of life tends to be fairly structured uh, because that's what the first stage of life is about. It's about building the container. Mm. Uh, and so people will uh, have uh, uh, fairly organised expressions mm. of spirituality and that's really important um, what one of the the important things to acknowledge is that the first stage of life is important and the building of the structures is very important you 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 can't have a healthy second stage of life uh, unless you've had a, a well-lived healthy first stage uh, and it's uh, it's important that you'll notice as I'm, I'm on a number of occasions, and notes on a number of occasions, that um, the trouble is with the second stage of life is that they can get stuck in some of the first stage rules. Mm. Um, and he, he says something like, you know, what is important in the morning uh, becomes irrelevant in the evening. Mm. And, uh, and that's an important thing for second stages. Uh, to two parts of that's important. One is that they can recognise that for them that some of those structures and rules are no longer important. That they have in some way been liberated 
uh, to explore a, a spirituality. Um, but a healthy second stage will acknowledge that they are still important for their children. Uh, and they will help them be, uh, maintain uh, part of that container building stuff, although it may not, no longer seem relevant to them. They'll acknowledge that it is relevant. Mm. So a healthy spirituality is able to, I think, engage on a number of levels as we enter the second stage of life. We, we don't try and tear down the first stage for others mm. who need to be there. Uh, we'll help them to, to journey through that. So spirituality uh, in, in, in all its forms, there isn't a human being uh, without it. Mm. Uh, and I think to be able to acknowledge that and to appreciate that uh, others have uh, different forms of it mm. uh, is really important for a, a healthy second stage of life and to be able to journey with others who have uh, different expressions, mm. very important.